Well, welcome back. It is a bittersweet day for me today. After nearly four years at Fox 17, my last day of work will be this upcoming Wednesday. And today is my last time incurring your weekend mornings. I told myself I'm not going to cry <laughs> and I'm already now. feeling it. Well, while I've loved every moment here at the station and in West Michigan, it's always been a top priority for me to be close to my family. From the stories I've covered, both good and sad news and everything in between, I have cherished the opportunity to be able to tell them to you each morning. I want to say thank you so much for tuning in and for being so supportive. Without you tuning in each morning, turning your TVs on, we would not be able to do our jobs. To my coworkers, turned work family and lifelong friends, thank you for helping me create memories that I'll remember forever. It's so hard to say goodbye to a place I've built a life in, but I know you'll always welcome me back with open arms to visit. Thank you so much from the bottom of my heart for welcoming me into your living rooms and workplaces, trusting me to bring you your news each morning. It has truly been an honor, and I will forever be proud to call West Michigan home. And of course, it wouldn't feel like a weekend morning without the person I started it with. We have a special guest who surprised me this morning, Isabella. Hi, friends. <laughs> Welcome back. <laughs> it's probably Hello. weird waking up this early now, right, being in the studio. <laughs> Wait, come in camera. Yeah. She's off camera. There, oh, there she, she is. is. Okay. <laughs> Thank you so much oh. for surprising me this morning. It has been so good working with you. Don't cry. You're not allowed to cry. So I'm actually standing up in Isabella's wedding. So we're. Oh. this is an example of a lifelong friend, OK? Yeah. Yeah. Um, and so it has been so great, you know, being able to wake up with you guys. And of course, um, Reese has joined us too this yeah, morning on weekend morning. So now you guys have. It's been a pleasure. Been you, up to you've that. taught me a lot, helped me get in the groove of things here for yeah. the 2 a.m.s and how to eat ramen at 6 a.m. <laughs> he now eats his lunch at, yeah, yeah, at 6 dinner for breakfast. <laughs> well, Reese. I suppose we should do a final check of the forecast. Yeah, one last <laughs> check of that seven-day forecast for us here. 75 degrees today, sunny conditions, breezy through the afternoon. It's a pretty, pretty good end of the weekend, all things considered, especially how we started it. Isolated shower here Monday afternoon. Could be some light accumulations. We'll get back to the 80s for the middle of the week. And with that, rain chances move in. So, Lauren, your last day is Wednesday. And after that, it's all rain. I think it's pretty fitting. All right. Sad, sad, days. sad, sad days yeah. to come. It's OK. <laughs> well, uh, we have enjoyed being here. I have enjoyed being here. Again, West Michigan, thank you yeah. so, so much. Thanks so much for watching us here on Fox 17 Weekend Mornings. We'll always have more online content. In And we are back. <laughs> We're just kidding. <laughs> they tried to end early on yeah. us, but don't forget you can stream us and take us with you 24-7. Fox 17 will be right back here next weekend. Take care, West Michigan.